Hey guys, so this is going to be kind of a fast video. Um, I wanted to get uh, this documented on film though at least. This is a very simple process in the procedure, but a very essential one uh, if you don't know about it. What you're looking at here, this little pulley looking thing on the end of the timing gear that's kind of offset. You can see it's bolted more toward the top. And then if you look in here, you'll see evidence of the pin that ran through the camshaft. This is actually called a mechanical fuel pump eccentric. And what this does essentially is every time that the cam spins and makes one full revolution, uh, it pushes the lever of the mechanical fuel pump up and down, which, which the mechanical fuel pump would ride in this direction here and the lever kind of rests on it. So every time this oblong disc is moving up and down, it's, it's pumping the fuel, pump uh, the fuel pump lever up and down. That causes uh, the pump to actually work and that pump, that's what pumps fuel into your carburetor. So a couple of important things I want to notate here, and I'm sorry I didn't document the installation of this. This is very straightforward though. Um, with your camshaft, you're going to have two pins that come with it. You're going to have a short pin and a longer pin. You want to use the longer pin in this situation because you need the pin to over penetrate the cam sprocket and come in right underneath uh, the, this, uh, the, the, the uh, cam retaining bolt here. You can see the evidence of the pin right here. This pin has to be in place because that's what keeps this in, in sync. If this pin was not here and this bolt came loose, then you would essentially lose your pumping ability and everything would, would, be, would be really destroyed in here. So make sure you use the longer cam pin uh, and make sure you install your eccentric when you're converting one of these newer uh, five liter EFI motors over to a mechanical. So, Nice little uh, under two minute video here. I hope this helps you guys out. If you need any other uh, questions answered on these uh, eccentrics, you can always uh, shoot me an email through the website and take a look at uh, 302budgetbuild.com for all the pictures. Thanks guys.